Nine games to go, five points off table toppers Burnley. The championship title race is certainly set to be a thrilling one for Middlesbrough fans this season. Their recent dip in form has seen them lose three games in their last five outings, and it's come at just the wrong time, so it's time to turn things round tonight at Loftus Road as they face a Queen's Park Rangers side that's lost just one of their last seven league outings. Anua with the throw, looking for options here. As Rangers look to try and get on the front foot early on. That's well played by Cherry down the right sideline. Back to the right back, Anua. Well worked out of a tight corner. Cherry again loses it. Drops here for Farlin. We'll have a go from range, and it's straight down the throat of Constantopoulos. Relatively easy one for the borough keeper to deal with. Good tester, though, early on. Gets him involved nice and quickly. Ball over the top. Poulter complaining he was pulled back. Borough will bring it out from the back. It's a good ball over the top. And Jordan Rhodes might get onto this one here. And he's rounded the keeper. And he's managed to tuck it into an empty net. Jordan Rhodes, his second goal since arriving at Middlesbrough, gives them the lead in this massive clash. And the away fans are delighted onside. A disastrous mix up at the back. Really, it should have been dealt with by Grant Hall. It's a good ball forward from Grant Ledbetter, the captain. Rhodes able to divert it away from the defender on the line. Give Borough the breakthrough inside 20 minutes. That's what they brought him in for at the end of January. This is the incident leading up to the goal. You just see Sebastian Poulter having his shirt pulled there. Gibson's all over it. QPR fans will be very unhappy. The Rangers didn't get a free kick. Harassment from Poulter, but it's moved out to Kass, who gives it away in a very dangerous position. Farlin plays it forward. Cherry once more. No space to shoot. Able to get past his man, though. Poulter dragged down to the ground. Right on the edge of the box, perhaps just inside. And again, he doesn't get the free kick that he wants. Beautiful work by Cherry. And surely that's a free kick. Clayton all over him. It's an arm round the forward's legs. And pulls him down to the ground. Not sure it was inside the box, though. Jimmy Floyd Hasselbank having a word with the fourth official. Wondering what his forward needs to do to get a free kick. Karanka in the meantime, watching on as the ball comes into the box. And it's Mackie will have a go! In off the underside of the bar! And the referee finally blows for it. A super hit from Jamie Mackie. His first goal of the season pulls Queen's Park Rangers level. It's a fine strike on the turn. It certainly crossed the line after rattling the underside of the crossbar. Going backwards as he hits it, it's a really difficult effort. The Borough defence can't be called into question too much. That's an excellent equaliser. Lofted over the top, looking for Rhodes, who brings the second ball down and under control. The Doma. Downing. It back here, Stuart down and right on the edge of the box. He'll have a go, but it's always sailing up and over and wide of the target. It's where he likes them, Stuart Downing. But just couldn't keep that one down, unfortunately. Too much space, though, considering his shooting prowess on the edge of the 18 yard box. Picked out wide by Ramirez. Doma. Doesn't find a way through. Half-hearted claims for handball by those Middlesbrough fans behind the goal. Is it Omer again? Lovely run into the channel. And he's been brought down. And the referee immediately points to the spot and Borough have a penalty. 
McFarlane clumsily bringing the winger down to the ground from behind. It was wonderful work over on that far side. A great ball in from Ledbitter. Nadoma happy to take the contact. No choice for the referee but to point to the spot. Smithies against the captain Ledbitter. the keeper superb save at full stretch one-handed but it was a strong hand down to his right still have to deal with this corner though Rangers whipped in by Lepita and it's Ramirez at the near post and just like that Middlesbrough find the back of the net after Smithies made such a superb save from the spot kick A neat flick on, and there's nothing the keeper could do about that. Woeful defending at the near post. Naito Karanka is delighted with that one. And coming forward again here, Borough. Moves out wide to Adoma. Now he's looking to take on Perch at the moment. Back to the edge of the box. That's a lovely ball to pick out Friend. It's a very good save from Smithies to keep his side in this. And George Friend with acres of space on this near side. Excellent two-handed stop. Quick free kick. And he's found the back of the net. It's Ben Gibson. Rangers caught off guard. And Barra take a 3-1 lead, and it was all too easy for the centre-back to get his head onto that one. Woeful defending again at the set-piece. Launched into the box, but Nua can't find a teammate. Hoyt's clear. And just trying to keep the pressure on here with Hall. Back to the captain. Clipped into the box by Carl Henry. Got it down, Cherry with the strike. Cherry just couldn't find the target. Good work by Poulter. Staying strong with that aerial challenge. The attacking midfielder. Unable to pick his spot. Just see Jamie Mackey there. Getting a bit of attention on the bench. Goal scorer to come off. He's been in the wars this evening. Henry. It's a good ball over the top to pick out Hoylet, who gets down to the byline, pulled back, oh it's been blocked as well, the whistle's already gone, the goal won't stand for Poulter. Some woeful defending from Middlesbrough this time, great effort by the substitute, yeah, picked up a bit of a knock there, as he tried to keep that in and he did keep it in as well. Angela. Oh, he's lost it. Faffing around at the back, and this could be four. It's a good stop again by Smithies. Rhodes quick as a flash onto the loose ball, trying to capitalise, but the keeper stayed big. Poor clearance straight to the feet of Poulter. Not given up yet, QPR. Here's Cherry, he'll have a go, and he'll find the corner. Super strike that will give Middlesbrough a nervy final nine minutes or so, plus stoppage time to this one. Too much time and space from 25 yards out. Constantopoulos gets a hand on it, perhaps should have done a little better the Middlesbrough shot stopper. But a great strike from Cherry. He's deserved something this evening. Needs to go forward and away. And that's exactly where it goes. And the break's on suddenly here. And the substitute Forshaw's up if and Sue can find him. And Forshaw is found, but he sends it wide of the target. Unselfish from the fullback and Forshaw just couldn't wrap it all up. Cleared forward by Smithies. Last chance saloon for Rangers. 
the full-time whistle goes. Aitor Karanka celebrates. Middlesbrough go within two of Burnley at the top of the championship table. Jimmy Floyd Hasselbank having words with his opposite number before heading down the tunnel. It's been a feisty finish to this well-fought battle, but it's the Borough fans that will go home happy tonight. They'll take three points back north, the final score, QPR 2, Middlesbrough 3.